What's up, everybody? Got 2008 Silverado 1500 doing ignition coil replacements. Let's go. Yeah, before I had a old F-150, decided to sell it. You know, hated to watch her go, but had to let her go. So I got me a 2008 Silverado 1500 photo. 5.3 uh, that's, that's kind of pretty be putting the initial coils in there real quick it's right you I'm gonna be switching them out real real fast Get another vehicle do your oil chain you're going to do your do your little tune up spark plugs and all that and now Get transmission flush and all that good jazz, but yeah. Today I'm gonna just show y'all about putting these in. It's real. It looked like it's real easy. It's my first time doing it. First time owning the Chevy, really. Get to it. Watch this for a little bit. What you gonna need in this one is your uh, 10 millimeter socket and, and a ratchet. Probably an extension. Yeah, that's about it. That's about all you're gonna need right now. Do it. Man, she pretty clean in there. Thing I like about this, well, she ain't clean, kinda dusty. I clean it off. The uh, thing about this, I like about these Chevys, it's wide open over here. Look at all that space. It's about the only thing right here that's, that's blocking. So all of those exposed right there. These over here, still relatively open. Ain't too, ain't too bad. I'll be able to get these out. Just gotta get to these clips. Hopefully none of them clips break off whenever I gotta disconnect. Matter of fact, first things first, disconnect the battery. That's the first thing I'm gonna do. Just thought about that. Yeah, disconnect them all. Uh, they got dog on battery. Then you get to work. All right. <clears throat> and I got the battery loose and all that good stuff. You feel me? All right, so with these, you can see these two 10 millimeter bolts right here. And then you got the clip right there. That's what you're gonna undo. You see it probably on it. Ah, can't see it. But you see the clip right there, right there. That's the one you're gonna take loose from this ignition coil. And then you're gonna undo the spark plug wire right there. All you do is just pull that off, give it a little yank yank, and you'll be good to go. Take, you can do that, repeat that process through the whole side right there. You got a lot of space on this side, and, and I don't know about the other side. But um, once you, once you finish replacing one side, crank up, Make sure everything good, everything not good, then you know it's a problem on the other side because all of these over here are gonna be new. Should not be a problem with the newness. So, that'll narrow down one side for you. You had that one done. And then, shut the truck back off, disconnect the battery again. Then you can replace all of them on that side right there. And it should be good to go. Should be running smooth, smooth, smooth. Yep, I am uh, I'm gonna knock one off. Show y'all how to do it, and then we be good. Well, I'm gonna hook this bad boy first. Got that out of there. And now to take these loose. Well, hold up. Mm-hmm. Didn't really make that noise. I made that noise myself. <laughs> yep, got that loose right now. Now to just take them two off and then snatch your own off. Hell. All right, 
That's a good thing to have, just in case you drop one of them bad boys. Have you a, a magnetic system or have one of these right at you. Just in case you drop something in the hard to reach that spot. Take this right here. You can snag that bad boy on the side of there. All right. I got the old one up out of there. Grab this new one. Grab this newness. Don't mind the weapon. Grab this newness. Mike Shop Dice Strike. Same issue. And we load them back on now. Got these screw right there. Phoebe. Got my left hand going to work. Yeah, I'm gonna have to prop this bad boy up somewhere. Alright. Well, what's gonna have to happen is I'm gonna have to get me a, a step stool or something. Get all the way in here. And when you tightening it back up, you don't have to do a ridiculous amount of torque on there. Let's get it nice and snug in there, you feel me? Right now I'm doing it hand tight first. Then I'm gonna reconnect. Listen for the snap. You feed me. That in there. Plug this one back up. Listen for that click. We did this car pass by. All right. I don't know if y'all heard that. That was a little cool, little cool sounding noise. But there you go, my yo's. Tighten. We good to go. Got it back in there. We solid, baby. On to the next ones. It's gonna be a little more difficult to get around here. But you got it right there. This thing just lifting right up. So, boom, boom, bap. Same issue all the way down. All right, that's it. Y'all, that's it right there, man. Got these other ones, huh? But that's relatively all you got. Come to the other side. You're gonna have to move some stuff out the way. Got that. You just pop these right here. Just pop these hoses off. So you can have a little room, just bop, bop. You like that? Just slide it on out of there. I don't know if you saw it, but yeah. Slide it on up out of there, that one. And then you just get to reaching. And that's it. I'm about to get to reaching myself. That's how it's gonna look when I'm all in there. She running smooth, I just did a little test drive, test run with it. She runs smooth, all of them locked up. Nice and tight, you're good to go. So, if you can do it yourself, do it yourself. If you don't want to do it yourself, go to the shop. If you doubt yourself, go to the shop. You don't want to, you don't want to do nothing if you doubt yourself, you're gonna break something. But right, anyways, that's the end of the video. Got your girl running smooth. About to wash it up. And shoot, that's it, man. Oh, this weekend, I heard it's a, a big car slash truck show going on in Jacksonville, Florida. I'm gonna be shooting down there. If y'all if y'all around the area, man, Jacksonville, Florida, I um, you can hit me up in the comments. I'll, uh, I'll let you know the location and all that uh, and the time. I forgot what it was. I got a screenshot of it. It's from Fold 8. All right, y'all, this is it right here. You got the address right there. 
five dollar entry, twenty dollar registration if you're trying to compete. And yep, that's it. But, yep, gonna be head down there this weekend taking the kids. Probably take my lady. She want to go. But yep, that's it, man. Y'all be safe. Y'all have a good one. We out.